Ladies and gentlemen of the internet, how are you all doing? I do hope you all are having a fantastic day. So we're here today with six minimum wage workers was one secret millionaire. Woo! So we've just, from well, I, I, I say we when I say when I mean me at this point. Um, but I've just gone through the the previous one that you that you'll already have seen on the channel, which is the uh, six married people versus one liar. Um, which was very fun to react to. Now, this one will come out probably like two weeks after that. So we're going to keep going and um, doing these at a rate of like one every two weeks or so. So uh, we're going to be going through a lot of these. So if you're new here, ladies and gentlemen, well, be sure to subscribe, you know, if you're interested in seeing my reaction, my thoughts on these. Um, so we've got Sigmund Wage Reactors so was one secret millionaire. Who could I be the secret millionaire? <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> no, I can't. I'm broke. <laughs> I'm broke. I've been broke for a while now. Woohoo! Yeah. I'm not really too bothered about that to be completely honest. Um, I like money. That's 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 why this episode sounds very, very fun, because I like money, right? I um I'm the finance when it comes to my circle of friends and even just family members and so on, I'm the financial guru. As crazy as that sounds. I'm the financial guru. I'm the person that uh, invests money. I'm the person that trades stocks. I'm the person that trades uh, crypto. I'm the person that has two businesses, right? Doesn't mean I'm rich. No. Um, but I'm, I'm the kind of, I'm the get go. I'm the kind of person that goes out there and is like always like trying to find ways to make money make me money. In the simplest way possible, which is why I always like talking about, I, I like talking about fines, I like talking about money a lot, um, that's kind of, I wouldn't say a hobby of mine, but um, I do very much like doing that, uh, so I feel, I felt like this one is perfect, because this one involves like my hobbies of deduction, <laughs> yeah, combined with um, money, um, so like this to me is just a very fascinating episode, it's a very interesting episode, I'm very much interested to seeing how this goes, um, but yeah, We'll see what we we got. We can, um, we guys can figure it out. Um, let me know who you think. You know, during the episode, let me know who you think. If you haven't seen this, of course, let me know who you think is suspicious. It'd be fun if you like it, while you're watching this, like you write your thoughts on like each round. That I think that would be great because I like you know you post your comment at the end. I'm like I can look back at it. I'm like ooh, yeah, I can definitely see what you're saying right there. Ooh, no, you were wrong. Ha 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 ha. Instead of like just like a you know a post, uh, like after finishing the video, writing a comment and being like, oh, you know what, I could see it was him. No, but uh, yeah, you know, not my thing. But like I would love to see your thought process, like on your journey, um, going through this while, you know, hearing my thoughts as well. I think that would be a great way to go about it. But besides that, ladies and gentlemen, let us hop right in. As I always say, you know, please go please go check out and support the original creator, Jubilee, which I will have linked in the description down below so you guys can check it out. And then let's watch this together. He's Evan. She's Kendra. And this is Odd Man Out. Six minimum wage workers versus one secret millionaire. A big thank you to our sponsor, Dashlane, for supporting this episode. Stick around after the episode to learn how you can get your first device for free and for an extra special offer from Dashlane. We will see you then. Okay. Asian American males make the highest median average income. How do you think I'm Asian? Following white males. Oh, that's a, I don't know. What? Sorry, let me go back. Dashlane. I mean, we'll, we'll hear that during the episode. Asian American males make the highest median average income. How do you think I'm Asian? Following white males. Oh, that's a, I don't know. What? <laughs> we brought together seven minutes. Okay, based off appearance alone. Based of appearance, they, they all look Huh. This this is gonna be difficult, <laughs> but like just just judging, right? Based of appearance alone, they all look very millennial, and that's the issue. Except him. Except him, because which makes him for me the most suspicious one. It was just a bad way to a bad way to start. As you know, but like for me, he's like the, he's the millionaire that became rich. You know, you can kind of tell by his back. And by his arms, like everyone else, you, know, you see those today are quite healthy, and obviously millionaires can be quite healthy, so on and so forth. Um, but like to me, uh, to me, he's the most suspicious one because of his back. As stupid as that sounds, he's young, so he's not old. Like if he, if he's an older millionaire, you know they usually are very much like okay, 
you know, back straight and everything perfect, right? But because, to me, he's like the millionaire that became rich through like a software. Like he was the he was the IT guy, um, and that's why his back is like that's why my back is like that. You know, he's the IT guy and his back is like that. Um, and now, like slowly but surely, it's straightening. And uh, you know, now because now that he doesn't have to work anymore, I know it's a very stupid way to look at it, but that's kind of my thought right off the get go. But it's that's, that, that's not what you're not here to like just look at based on appearance, we're here to listen to the arguments. Minimum wage workers, I am a minimum wage worker, 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 I am a minimum wage worker. One is a liar. If the group discovers the I have a different suspicion right now, but I'm, I won't say it. The liar is, they'll split a cash prize. Not yet. If the liar I want to hear the argument he or she first. Wins the entire prize. <laughs> I live in Orange County. Rent is. Mm, it's hard. It's hard, but I'm hanging there. Which so. city? The, the bad side. He was just like hesitating so much, and it just looked like he was lying. I live with my parents also, so. You know what? What's, what's his name? Jimmy. I was respecting Jimmy. Uh, and I won't get, tell you why just yet. Let me just hear this round play out and then I'll tell you my thoughts at the end of this round. But I'm suspecting him a lot. I'll say that a lot. It's hard, but I'm hanging there. Which so. city? That right there as well. The bad side. He was just like... The bad side. like... So much and it just looked like he was lying. I live with my parents also, so zero rent and I live downtown. Main focus when I get my paycheck. Pokeball. And my rent. That's it. Pokeball. How old are you? I'm, I'm 23. I'm 43. And you still live with your parents? For oh my goodness, I'm terrible of age. Oh, I thought he was like, you know, early 30s, like 31, 43. Oh, then the back. Ooh, then I might be wrong with his back. I thought he was like, see, that's why I'm terrible of like, trusting my parents. Oh my goodness, I thought he was like, you know, 30, maybe 31. And like, you know, he just became a millionaire at like 28, you know, while doing some IT computing work. And then now it's like slowly his back is like getting better. But I think, mm -mm, nah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I might have been wrong. I suspect Jimmy as of right now. Yeah, because I'm 20,000 in debt. It's just an opportunity to try. It's hard. I'm a Uber driver and I'll, I have a van. Funny thing, I'm actually starting uber delivery soon <laughs> it's a great thing to do when you try to exercise especially like from you guys can't see it but i'm let's just call me chunky all right there's another reason the camera stops here so like i thought ooh, i could ride a bike i can do some exercise while delivering food perfect way to make some money on the side and like i got the van because i thought i'd be able to make more money doesn't but instead i'm paying so much in gas i wish i would have got a prius i feel like you're trying really hard to make it sound like you're broke no i'm not broke i'm twenty thousand in debt so that's like the same thing though it's not what do you do for it debt no no no. there is good debt and there is bad debt he didn't say what kind of debt but there is good debt and there is bad debt. i like using i like leveraging debt i'll say that much like debt to me is i like debt i like getting more and more debt if you know how, if you know what good debt is, you know not the bad debt where you like you, you can't make ends meet, but like the good debt where you like, all right here, yeah yeah, I've got a little bit of debt here, you know, it's good. There, there are very many, there are a lot of ways to leverage debts, so don't get that wrong. Twenty k in debt does not mean you could you could be a millionaire and have twenty k in debt. That's you, or you could be broke and have twenty k in debt, and it's like it doesn't really make much of a difference. You both, you can be both positive. Both can be positive. Both can be massively negative. No, I'm not broke. I'm twenty thousand in debt. So that's like the same thing, though. What do you do for work? I almost suspect her now. I don't. What, what's her name? Drinking so much in gas. I wish just, I got a Prius. Damn it! Doesn't I tell me. Really hard I, I suspect her now I'm because of that comment. Twenty thousand in debt. So that's like I, the same thing, though. I don't suspect him at all. Me, I'm art consultant. Art consultant. Yeah. Where? So I sell artwork at a different hotel. Oh, that's big money. Those can be. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nah. <laughs> it's really not. I had a friend. Uh, from, you know, also, well, not. A I can't call him a friend. Let's call him a co-worker. A, a place that I worked for like two weeks. <laughs> but like he used to be. Uh, he used to be an art consultant, uh, fresh out of university. And then he was like, Nah, you know what? This. I was getting paid like fifty-five k. It's like that. That's not worth it. I, I studied. Eight years at university, you know, doing my degree and doing my master's, uh, and now, uh, you know, in four years' time, I would have made fifty-five k. That's not that much. 
uh, you know, that, that, that didn't even pay the tuition, honestly. So it, he then moved to the job that I was doing for like three weeks, which was like salesman. So like that tells you everything you need to know. Okay. It's not big money. No, artists and art dealers are not rich at all. Yeah. <laughs> unless they're like one of the top Rich. Ones. Yeah, exactly. How much per month would you say you get in commissions? I've only sold two pieces my entire four years. How much did you get for them? The piece I sold was like $2,000. You said you sold two pieces and you've been there for how long? Four years. Yeah, and that's why it's really hard. How are you not terminated, though? <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. I, I don't know what you mean. It's well, because for like a luxury, it's, like, it's really hard for a young person to develop like a client list where they can call and stuff. And like, oh, right, right. all my friends cannot, you know, I wish my parents can purchase that kind of painting. But So I go by like, demographically, I know how things work. You know, like. Uh, Asians? I know. Is Asian, that what you say? Asian American males, man. That, that, that's <laughs> I was, I was, that's why I wasn't going to say it, because it's a very stupid argument to make, but that was my thought as well at the beginning, where I was like, uh, Asians in America, I, I don't live in America, but like Asians in America, Asians in the world are generally, you know, very much, um, demographically, they're always the richest people, because of the strong uh, focus on, uh, on education. Um, that's why, like, typically, like, Asians, you know, you, you see them a lot of the time. I, I mean, I, I know, like, I've got 10 Asians that I could call friends. Like, Asian, when I say Asian, I mean, I'm talking about, like, uh, Chinese, Japanese, uh, Korean, um, like, like m Oriental Asians. Um, and one is, a compu one is a programmer, two are doctors, two are accountants, no, three are accountants, I think the other person is design graphics, and uh, the other person uh, works in art. So it, it, just just say it, all right? Like, like just you look at that, and like yeah, all of them have sort of made it <laughs> because we all used to like study, you know, together. Uh, that's kind of how we all we used to play League of Legends all the time while studying. So we'd be, we'd play it and be like, okay, so have you done this problem for maths? And I'm like, yes. So the answer I got was like, you know, X. Uh, X, whatever, X, uh, yeah, okay, but watch out, uh, uh, Ymir is coming, uh, well, <laughs> watch out, Timo is coming at you, so that's kind of how we studied, that's how we got, that's how we all got A stars, I guess, <laughs> because we studied playing video games, it works. The highest median average income, how do you think I'm Asian? following white males, oh, that's a, I don't know, but <laughs> going just by what I think I know, it's hard. Even though maybe statistics may say that, but it doesn't really apply to a smaller group yep. like us. Do you That's shave true. your legs? Nah, I don't you don't shave your legs? When I saw the basketball shorts and the unshaved leg, I was like, okay, that's one of the signs. Do you shave your legs? That, that doesn't help because I fell down. <laughs> I just injured myself a few days ago. So let me show that leg. It looks much better. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, that doesn't help. Uh, my knee is, it looks like a mess now, <laughs> I have to say. But oh, well. Oh, well. That's what you get for running in the snow, doing your, again, exercise, running in the snow. Slipped. <laughs> unshaped leg I was like okay that's one of the signs do you shave your leg no okay so see that's a sign sign of what <laughs> of someone, of I someone. feel like that's you deflecting no, 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 something no, no, no. Shave legs. okay I no I shave no no no, no. I, sh I shave oh my god he, had, uh, he hasn't actually said anything like he was quite the entire round same as those two the questions were terrible immediate guess is I suspect him, but I almost don't. 43. If he was 30, I, I would have suspected him, but I, I would suspect his demographic. Mm, it, it, mm, and then him with the whole, oh, a bad era. Mm, art. Nah, he, I, he's too young for that. I, he's too young to really. But if you're only making. Why are you working there for four years, though? We don't know anything about these. So I can't really say anything. He was just talkative. We don't even know what he works at. Like, like, like there were no questions. He just seemed kind of sus, so like, get him out. He asked too many questions, and nobody else said anything. Well, Jimmy, see ya. Ah, oh. 
that makes me sad. We think you're a millionaire. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> I'm broke. I'm kind of surprised that other people didn't vote out Kevin and David, like the first round. I look poor, Jesus. <laughs> there are lots of things looking poor. I know plenty of, well, I, 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 I shouldn't talk like that, but I do know millionaires and I do know people that have millions, all right? Uh, my grandparents. Uh, they, <laughs> well, at this point, it's just my grandma, I guess, but yeah, you know, they had plenty. Um, not to go into the specifics, but they had plenty. They don't look any different than me. Well, besides the fact that I'm mixed race, I'm half white, half black, and they're white, um, but that's a, that's a different point, all right? Uh, that's the only difference, yeah, skin color. Besides that, there is actually, they don't look that much different to me. Besides the fact that they always wear a shirt, uh, always wear nice clothing, you know, and I, I generally prefer just comfortable clothing, even when I go out. That's like the difference. They wear the shirts at home, iron shirts. I'm like, nah, I just, I, I just put on whatever I find, bro. <laughs> but like, besides that, there is no real difference. So like, going by that, it's just, you need to, you need to go off what they're saying. How about this? I feel like everybody has this when they're a kid. Like, what would you do if you were a millionaire? Like, what's the first thing you do? I would, well, honestly, like, invest it into, like, businesses to get more money. Nah. Nah. I was with her when she said invest. I was like, oh. And then there's an into bit. I'm like, nah. Because how are you going to invest it into businesses? If, if let's, let's say you win a lottery, right? How are you going to invest it into businesses? The, the way she's phrased it, I know it, I might be misinterpreting it, but the way she's phrasing it to me sounds like business, like like Dragon's Den you're, you, or Shark Tank. You're investing it into businesses. You don't have the knowledge. You don't have the knowledge of what is a good business, what is a bad business. Unless you have made money doing so. Like, you're not just going to invest a million into that. So that's why I feel like right now she, maybe it's just because of the way I'm interpreting. If she had just said investing into stock companies, right? You don't need to do much research for that. Like, you don't need to know if the product is good. You don't need to know. You, you put, you know, you, you get the, you get the S&P 500 or FTSE or whatever, you know, you put your money in there, you put a million in there, you know, at 3% uh, dividends a year. You know, uh, okay, you might not put a whole million in there, but let's say you put a whole million in there. Uh, at three percent dividends a year, you're looking at uh, thirty-three, three hundred, thirty-three thousand, right? Um, thirty thousand. You're looking at thirty thousand a year, right? You you put you invest a million into the in into the S and P. Uh, you're making about thirty thousand a year just from your dividends alone, enough to live off of. So that I would have said, okay. She's too smart. <laughs> it's stupid as I said, she's too smart. But the fact that she said investing into business, I'm like, hmm. She had said properties, I would have said, okay, you know, you don't need that much knowledge to go into properties. Fair enough. You know, you could you could build a portfolio of say 10 properties. Yeah, free properties, free good properties. I know what your net worth would increase. You get better credit cards. I'm going like full on sensei mode right now. But you get better credit cards. You get better. Uh, you, you you could build your credit. You could um, once once the houses have been paid off. I'd always recommend getting a mortgage. I wouldn't recommend paying it off right away. I'd say get a mortgage. You know, and, and then like just slowly um, put slowly put your money in there. Maybe invest the rest of it, and then like get, um, pay off, pay it with your dividends or whatnot with your investments. Um, but she. I'm less suspicious of right now, to be completely honest. Business right now, an online business, but I just started it two, so like businesses get more money. I have a business right now, an online business, but I just started it two months ago. How's it doing? So it's going like. Okay. What well, is it online I business? I started it two months ago, and I'm a full time student, so it's like hopefully it grows. So when I'm out of college, I could. What's like, ask, I what the business is? What is it? It's just an online boutique. She was a little bit suspicious because she does seem like a very intelligent woman. No, 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 no. I don't suspect her. I actually don't suspect her. You suspect someone has a business, oh yeah, it's a red flag. But no, I actually think that is not a red flag. As ridiculous as that sounds. That's the fact that she came out with it. Because that would make it a red flag. But that to me means that she is not a red flag. As ridiculous as it sounds. I've got a business. I've got two businesses, right? One of them 
Well, one of them earns me money whenever I buy and sell. Uh, I haven't done that because of the quarantine. But like before that, it used to make me, I don't know, 60k a year, something like that. Um, but a lot of work. Um, the second one is completely different. And, yeah, doesn't matter. That makes me zero. <laughs> woman who is capable of being she's smart i will say that but you majoring in the internet or what i'm majoring in my online classes which is accounting where do your parents live my parents live in eugene oregon yeah. didn't you say you live with them well they lived in eugene and then they moved to los oh. angeles <laughs> he said that he lived with his parents yeah. here and then he was like, oh, my parents are from Eugene, which is in Oregon. So I was like, ooh, he messed up his story. You said, where are my parents from? No, where do they live? Oh, they live in LA. Like West Side, East Side? West no, they, li they live downtown. You, uh, where do your parents live? You live in, a, in an apartment with your parents. I am, yeah. Okay. I mean, you're judging me for living with my parents? For some reason, I feel like him and her are the most honest. I don't know if it's the smiles or what, but <laughs> I feel like they're the I most mean, honest. I don't look rich. <laughs> What? Stop this. He is a little bit suspicious, that dude. Him. I will say that. I feel like he's lying about his age, though. <laughs> I feel like he's lying about his age, and that's why I'm suspicious of him. But I, he, his story... Under pressure, you say what you want. I, I, the questions aren't good enough yet. Her, I don't suspect. Well, goodbye, Kevin. Bye. Sorry, buddy. Sorry. When I got voted out, I felt all right. I mean, it kind of sucks if you get voted out. I was like Survivor. I feel like they were like putting out my flame and it was just like the end for me. I don't know, it kind of sucked. Raise your hand if you have any doubt. She's an influencer. She's you she's have a to be. Woman. She well, you're, a you're an woman. entrepreneur trying to do a boutique. You but have to be an I influencer. Feel like what? This guy's he's either a millionaire and he's playing the group against each other, which is a great move, or he's an idiot, which I don't think he is. So he's a millionaire. <laughs> Going about looks in this game isn't really going to get you far, if I'm being honest. That's not my strategy. If that's how you want to pinpoint people, that's totally fine. So the clothes aren't going to matter. Looks aren't going to matter. Who is the mole? I was really suspicious about Kevin. You are my next suspect because you're look, really me, outgoing and you're really. I confident. feel like it might be a girl. That's why I raised my hand. It's not going to be who I think it is, so it might be one of the girls. Like I hate to say that, but that's like kind of the way the world is. It's like you wouldn't suspect the girl, but I don't think that way. I think like you know, my mom's always been a boss. Like ever since I was a little kid, you know. So I hear what you're saying. I Stupid reason. As so leaders. Really Ask some questions, bro. Okay, we have 35 yeah. seconds, so. What's the most expensive? Someone ask him oh. a question. I can't. What do you like to do? What are your Look, hobbies? You yeah. what, what are your hobbies? What did your parents do? Yeah, where are your uh, parents? So live? my mom didn't work, but okay. my dad worked in construction for mm, I'm gonna say 30 years. Your dad just worked? Yeah. Would you say he had a pretty oh good gosh. childhood? <laughs> uh, yeah. I was just like, okay, I have to vote him out just to get him out of the way because he was starting to look suspicious to me. What? The, what? <laughs> Even ask a question, bro. Construction, you, you, you could make a lot of money on construction. But considering his father was a part of the store, you didn't even ask him about himself. You asked him about his parents. This is. The questions are so bad. That's my issue. I got y'all nerve. <laughs> I mean, I knew I was out. I could have, you know, I could have wrote down Jesus on, this, on the card and nothing would have changed. This time we're going to do a speed round. Just one minute. Please ask good questions. You said you have your own business online. Yeah, I just started it, like, at the end of July. I kind of wish I didn't mention my business. Like I said, I just started it two months ago. It's fairly brand new. Of course, I'm not a millionaire. You are not a millionaire. Trust me, I'm certain of it. You lot haven't asked the two other girls any questions. They've literally just been sitting there, like, paying the other people against each other. Ask them some damn questions. So how much do you make? Well, okay, I've made so far maybe like not even that much, like 700. Do you have a YouTube channel? I don't have a lot of subscribers on there. But you do. So you I, last time I made a video was like five months. <laughs> How many uh, followers on Instagram? Just like a thousand. Really a thousand like Instagram followers equals dollar sign. Okay, this guy's actually. An He's not the millionaire. <laughs> he's. I felt like he was the millionaire. And he's playing smart games, but the fact that he's saying that 
is stupid. I've got, look, I've got an Instagram account, right? Uh, that I created. I I, I mentioned it. I, I kind of I, I created a second business. All right, uh, and it was like a drop shipping business. Okay, cool. Um, I created an Instagram account. Follow like fifty people, and you get a thousand people. You, not, not quite a thousand. You get like hundred and fifty people following you back. And that was a brand Instagram. Like. It, 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 it's easy getting followers. You could just unfollow them and it looks like, oh, they're all following you, but you don't follow them. Woohoo, hey. Instagram, there is a lot of money that can be made there, but with a thousand, you're not getting anywhere. On YouTube, a thousand, she said, last video she uploaded was five months ago. Unless you're, ra to be a millionaire, like, look, I'm going to say it. She is pretty, all right? So, that, of course, you get a thousand Instagram followers. She is pretty. Right, um, but, but unless she has a million, there, there is, or, or unless she has like five hundred thousand, you're not making much from that on YouTube. Unless you have at like five hundred k, five hundred k subscribers, you're making maybe a hundred k a year, right? Just just random numbers, all right? If you if you upload consistently daily or whatnot, you're making maybe a hundred k a year. That's not rich. That's just I've got money. But that's not millionaire, secret millionaire. Unless she, unless she, unless she, unless she sells her products. Uh, last time we made a video was like five months. <laughs> How many I don't suspect her at all. He's an idiot, so I don't like, <laughs> sorry, I, I shouldn't say that. But he is asking stupid questions and he's saying stupid things. So I don't suspect him anymore. I suspected him at the beginning, but I don't suspect him anymore. Thousand. Especially because I thought he was the Thousand. computer guy. Instagram followers equals dollar signs. How many Instagram also, I wouldn't know how much Instagram followers make because when I did my uh, well, when I did my dropshipping business, guess where I turned to, which is why I created the, the, the company uh, Instagram account and got like a thousand followers. I went to Instagram, I messaged these influencers that had a million followers, that had 500,000 followers, and I was like, okay, I will pay you X, I won't get into the specific, or I will pay you X, Y, and Z for this amount um, of traffic, for these amount of posts. And most of them said, okay, a lot of them said no. A lot of them said I want a ref link and then so I can make money through that way. Many different ways, but you need to have at least 500k because otherwise people won't look at you. There are micro influencers, granted. I'm actually one of them. I've got a different, I've got way too many things going on to be completely honest. But I've got a different thing where I'm like, I'm micro influencers. I get sent a lot of goods um, to promote on in, on Twitter and whatnot. Um, but you're not making, you're not making much money. You're making, maybe as a micro influencer, you're making... I don't know, 200 there, 200 here, 200 there. You know, you're not making millions, right? Yeah, like 2,000 something. How about you? Like a thousand. See? How many jobs? A thousand. How much does your business account have? I just started I have 200. <laughs> Look, man, all three of them are cute. <laughs> so, look, man, there are tons of simps on the internet. That's all I'm going to say. There are tons of simps on the internet. So I'm, that to me, that makes complete sense. Complete, I'm not judging that at all. How much does your business account have? I, I have 200. <laughs> what, what is Insta? Oh my God. Because <laughs> she admitted that she was an entrepreneur. I, I had to vote for somebody. <sighs> the one person I'm sure wasn't. <laughs> You seem like you're hiding something, but I just... She has gotten away, basically saying nothing. <laughs> like, absolutely not being questioned at all. Oh, I don't know. Mm, my roommate dress is really nice. I honestly, like, I have no suspicions about you. Yeah. At the beginning, like, I, I didn't really suspect him, but I, if we're going to vote someone out right now, it's me. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's you. I'm sorry. Like, I watched Hustlers the other day, and, like, all the men that are spending all this cash, like, the fact like, that you're trying to point fingers yeah. makes me think that it's you. It's well, what it's else you. are we supposed to do? Like, I have to point <laughs> someone. You're trying to point at me, so am I just going to take it? You they all got kind of aggressive. And anytime somebody gets aggressive, it, start, it feels like they're lying. You're not going to make deal. The girls are teaming up against you, bro. Oh, I don't know. You're focusing on the wrong person, <laughs> huh? Bye. I'm sorry. Do you, do you guys have health insurance? It's through my mom. Yeah, same. For how old are you? I'm 22. <laughs> yeah. I'm 19. Okay. Look. She was going for girl power. I'm off. 
it's one of the girls. I don't know which one. I suspect her because she basically got in her way without being questioned at all. For it. But I also think it's her. It's one of the girls. I don't know which one. No, no, it's not the girl that got voted out already, but it's one of those two girls. I, I suspect. Mean, if you had a millionaire, you don't need the money. No, I would be so mad yeah. if the millionaire won the money, so I'm yeah. feeling pretty confident. Yeah. If the lights turn green, it's going to be the lights turn red. The liar is still in the box, and you lose. I swear, if these lights turn red. <laughs> Alright, last guess. He is suspicious. He is very suspicious. Um, because, again... I knew it. Yeah, his story didn't add up. I mean, you got the, like, alligator shirt on, though. <laughs> <laughs> like that looks like Gucci to me. I don't know. I knew it was the shoes and the organ thing. But I said it's his back because that's where I'm actually from. You know, once I started my YouTube channel and then things really started to like kind of take off, um, you know, things changed for me monetarily. But I'm still the same dude. Like I still wear these shirts. I still wear these you know dirty Nike shorts every day, like seven days a week, and I still wear flip flops like 99% of the time. Like nothing's changed besides you know some random numbers in my bank. Um, honestly, I didn't think I was gonna win. I don't know why. I just thought <laughs> something would happen. <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> I'm still mad. They barely asked her any questions. I'm going to match the winners, the amount the winners won, and I'm gonna give it to every single one of the losers too. So you guys all walk out of here. Oh, what a good guy! Wow. He's doing that because he's got a YouTube channel. That's why he's doing that. Positive PR. That's the. I, I see through you. Oh, yeah. I see so through you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thanks to Kevin, we all we're all winners today. Boo. Congratulations on catching them all. Yeah, and that was such a nice gesture at the end, giving them money. That was really sweet. Definitely. <laughs> a big thank you to Dashlane for supporting this episode. For those of you who don't know, Dashlane is awesome. It securely <coughs> generates and stores all of your password information across every device cool. so you never have to click lost password again. It can store your passport info, your Wi-Fi info, your banking info, and even auto- Yeah, I would never trust it. An app with that, right? Just, just saying. Um, but anyway, though, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, though, ladies and gentlemen. I sort of, I mean, this one I didn't have like a, a suspect I was homing in on. Um, I, you know, I, I, as, as you could tell, like every round I switched suspects. I kind of thought it was him, the round he was voted out. But like before that, I had no indications. After that, I wasn't like, it had to be him. But like his story didn't add up. So it was good on them for noticing that. But uh, yeah. The only person that I was 100% sure wasn't, wasn't the dude, was uh, this guy, <laughs> who I suspected at the beginning. It was him. Because his whole, like, oh yeah, you've got a thousand Instagram followers, haha, -ha, you must be rich. Like, no. 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 <laughs> where, where is the logic in that, bro? Uh, but yeah, maybe it's because he isn't that familiar with it. I thought, maybe it's, again, I thought he was 30, so I, I'm like, he should be very familiar with that, but if he was like, he said 42, he, maybe you could make an argument. You could maybe make an argument, man. But let me know whether you got it right, let me know whether you got it wrong, let me know what your thoughts were. Boy, these episodes, these, this show takes a lot out of me, I'll be completely honest. This show is a lot of fun, but I also get so furious sometimes because the lack of questions the lack of stupid questions like I, I, you know if you go back to the previous one that i did the one with rick i liked it because he was he had good questions he was worried out because he had good questions so maybe you don't have good questions because otherwise they think you're too smart and i don't know all right i don't know um but yeah ladies and gentlemen i will be seeing all of you in the next one i'm gonna, probably gonna be binging these if i'll be completely honest like this was the second episode in a row that i've done so i've sat i've sat you know for an hour the last one was i think 25 minutes long, this one is 35 minutes, so I've sat here for about an hour, and I'm probably going to continue more, so, I'll see you all in two weeks, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to see more of my videos, as I said, d could be coming out every two weeks or so, um, but if you want to see more, please go rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe, 
and I'll see you all then. We're currently on the road to a thousand subscribers. Then I'll be rich. <laughs> I went a little bit too finance nerd. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I do apologize about that. Like, I'm very passionate when it comes to money. All right. It's one of those weird things that I've always been passionate about. Because I'm like the most frugal person there is, right? I consider myself poor. I'm not, but I consider myself poor. Um, because of the way I live, which is basically just don't spend money on everything, on anything, invest everything. Kind of silly when you really think. I'm, I'm in the prime of my youth. 24, well, I'll be 25 by the time this video is out, but I'm in the prime of my youth. You know, I should be spending, I should be wasting money. Instead, here I am saving money. Damn. What a, sad, what a sad existence. But oh well, I'll see all of you in the next one, everyone. Until then, have a nice day. Peace out, and as always, bye.